so I'm just gonna jump right into it and start with the spell. This is work with Ochun. It's a couple and they're already dating. The girl wants a little bit more commitment. They've talked about it before. She kind of backed out of it um, in the beginning because she wasn't sure. Well, now she's sure and now the guy isn't bringing it up. So I'm going to do this for her. I don't foresee any difficult troubles. I feel like this is going to manifest quickly in a very positive way. So I am just going to start right away. I have his number. I'm, I'm sorry, his number, his name on here. I am going to put some love powder. Now, ideally, I would do this with clothes of the person. I would have you send me dirty clothes or I would have you make up a doll. Um, I'm going to put some, I have these phyllo sticks and I'm just going to, <clears throat> to put them in there. This one is Vencedor, which is, translates into Conquer para mi, which is for me. Guayaba, which is from a guava tree. Amansa Guapo, which is Tame the Bully. This one is what's going to make him docile. Amansa Guapo. Yo puedo más que tú. I can more than you. Dominador will dominate. Y no, no me olvides, don't forget me. Okay, that's basically just it. And then I'll start making the doll. And when you make these dolls, they don't have to be perfect. They really don't. So make a little hand here. Trying to concentrate, Helena. Can can I watch you, Mom, please? Yes, you can. I'm watching you. I'll do the other little hand. Mom, you're the best, Mommy. Shh, I know I'm the best. Thank you. Okay, and then now we uh, will make the little feet, the legs, I mean. Go. 
And this is one of the reasons that I also do not like to make videos is because when you make videos, I'm too focused on the video and showing you guys what I'm doing instead of focusing on the actual spell. But some people just want to see, so... And I'm not really worried about how I'm binding it right now. It's not until I bind both dolls together that I start really paying attention. Okay, so there's one. Okay, so there's one. Oh, shoot. Now I'm gonna work on her. And you know what? I forgot to put his stuff in, so. Then I'll do the same for hers with the sticks. Actually, I'm only gonna put vencedor, the vencedor stick in hers. Um, the dominate one, I put a little bit of the dominate one, but the, the conquering stick and the guayaba stick because I don't want her feeling, having more feelings than him. He has to be the one that's gonna bend over backwards for her, so. And on the girl doll, you want to leave this like a little dress. Just put arms, you can do arms on her, but, but no, um, no legs.
again, the dolls don't have to be perfect. Just gonna cut it a little bit more. Scissors aren't very good scissors. So here are the both of the dolls. I'm going to grab her picture and his picture and do this. And then his business card and a clothing tag is right there. Um, I should have put it inside, but I forgot. But it's okay. It'll still work. And then I'm just going to bind these together. And this is when you ask and you... you say you know the petition or whatever it is that you want so it's going to be silent for a while Okay, then I'm gonna get a pumpkin. It's a fairly small one. It's not that big. And I'm going to put 
some palm oil. I have the names. So I wrote his name five times and then I wrote her name five times over his name. So that it looks like this. And it goes. And go the dolls. And go the oils. This is control oil. Control isn't really an issue here, but I want her to be able to say, well, hey, babe, what do you think? Let's go do this. And he'd be like, oh, okay, yeah, sure. Yeah. Conquering love. Yeah. And you can use any oils. I want to use this one because I want him to be so in love with her that he feels like he can't, um, you know, keep on living without her. And then the tied up and nailed. Oops. I'll put a little bit more of the love powder in there. I'll put some of the red precipitation. Where is it right there? Fill it up with honey. Now this is gonna sit on Ochun for five days. Um, it, there's it, there's a sacrifice of two hens because that's what Ochun eats, either that or doves or quails. But in this case, we're gonna do two hens. And then I'm gonna take this pumpkin and go bury it in the river. That's pretty much it. After the fifth day, I go bury it and then wait about like a week and things will start moving.